Hey, you guys, guess what time of day it is. It is Dollar Tree time for you all. Hey, my friends. Hello, my family. How are you guys doing? I am doing great. Maybe. <laughs> no, I'm doing all right. Um, anyways, I'm hoping this sounds better because I actually went and purchased a microphone that I got for a really, really great price. So, please let me know if you can hear me better. My big mouth. Can you hear me now? <laughs> Anyways, these are readers. These are not new glasses. These are the eyes of the beholder. Right here. Hey. <laughs> so, how are you guys? What's going on? What's the 411 where you're at? Do tell. Do tell. Give me something to work with here. Um... It's the holiday weekend, and we really didn't have any plans. Our son was camping. I don't know if we wanted to come up for the day. I, I am just not into the outdoorsy stuff anymore. I guess I got old and decided that I never really was an outdoorsy person. I mean, I like being outdoors for a minute, but I do not enjoy a fire and bugs. Just, it's just not a thing for me anymore, you know? Um, I, I probably sound like an old lady. <laughs> And I don't mean to be that way. And my hair is thinner. Anyway, so I kept it down. What do you think? <laughs> anyways, um, how many times can I say anyways? Have you noticed? Have you counted? Background. And yes, it's a Dollar Tree tablecloth. And yes, it works for me. And yes, I like it. So how do you like me now? <laughs> I'm only playing. I got people out there that have my back. And I'm alright with that. And I even got a little... Cutie patootie in the old Chicago, Illinois that I just love and adore, but we're not going to mention no names. Okay? Not right now. Anyways. So, you guys, it's holiday weekend. Not a lot going on. Um, I'm dying to go see Cora. I, that's our great-granddaughter. She's four months old. She's just... She's got teeth already. She weighs a ton. And she smiles and loves her grandma Angie. That's my daughter. <sighs> just love that. I just love that. That is the greatest feeling in the world. It's kind of like when, you know, when Caitlin was born. That's my oldest granddaughter. I love that baby. <laughs> you know, she came into the world right when this Mimi needed her. We were called Mimi and Papa, just so you know, if you ever wonder what that is. I didn't want to be a grandma at the age that I was a grandma. And I thought, you know what? There's going to be a lot of, because we're divorced couple. Um, my ex-husband, our children's dad and I. And so he remarried and all this. And I'm thinking to myself, man, I don't want a bunch of grandma and grandpas running around. The kids are going to be confused. So I decided to call us Mimi and Papa. So that, that being said, you guys, let's get into this Dollar Tree Hawk. Because that's really what you're here for. And I can run my mouth all day, all night. And if you want me to, I will. But not right now. All right. So we got lots to show you. Lots to, lots and lots going on, you know. The DT is really stepping it up on some things. But let me, I got to get something off the chest right here right now. Yes, I am on a rant. Please tell me why we went to self-checkouts at the DT. I'm not happy about that at all. If I want to go to self-checkout, I go down down the road to uh, 8 or what is it, um, 5 and below. I'm just really disappointed that we don't have the cu direct customer service anymore. I am disappointed that, you know, we're going to this and I'm just like, why? And she, they're like, well, we'll gladly open up a lane for you. Yeah, you will. You say you will, but you're not going to. Because the ones up on Alpine, that ain't going to happen. And I don't, even go, I don't go there anymore. So I said, whatever. I'm probably sounding like a big old brat. <laughs> and I don't mean to be. It's just, it's hard for when you get older to change. I'm not talking about that change. I'm talking about when stuff changes and you're not ready for it, you know. And I'm not ready for the self-checkouts at the old Dollar Tree. I'm just not. So there you go. I, there is my rant for the day. Let's get into this Dollar Tree hop. Okay, okay. So I want to get this out of the way because it's breakable and I don't want it to get broken. So I found this. I'm very excited. I am not the artist when it comes to this thing. It's my son's girlfriend. Um, and then she probably let my granddaughter help. I don't know. We'll see. But I think these can be really cool. Sorry for the rumbling of the paper. Okay, so let me see how this is going. This is a ceramic book. Can you see that? I don't know if you can, but anyways, very cool, very cool. And then they had this one. 
And this is the spider. And I said, I got such a me dip spider pop. <laughs> I just thought those were really cool. I'm very excited that they've got some ceramic pieces there, you know? All right, I'm going to get rid of this. We're just going to throw it on the floor. All right, let's go to, uh, this was a big, huge find. I was so excited about this. I think I might have hauled these in my other haul, did I? If I did, sorry, just go with it. Okay. These are the Essentials Disinfecting Wipes. Kills 99.9% of viruses and bacteria. Um, you get 80 wet wipes and Renewing Rain and Lemon Orchard. What a find, especially this time of year. You know, we already got the sickness hitting other people's houses. I don't want it over here. No, sir. I can't afford to get sick right now. So this is a very good deal. You know, here's the th thing what I'm going to do with this. I'm getting one. I, I, my grandkids are named the four grands because of the four granddaughters. Then I got the in-betweens and I got the babies. Four grands are adults and um, I'm going to give, I hate giving them money or a gift card. They have to have something open. So I have a little gifty and they'll have something open. This will be good for the little apartments because I know that's coming soon. Yes, my son, your kids are going to, you know, they're going to, they're moving out. Tatum's already moved out, you know, she's got a baby. Okay, that was a good deal. So, let's go to this one. I got this. I needed some 20% uh, bonus. It's a scrub-free bathroom cleaner with foaming action. I'm hoping this is as good as scrubbing bubbles because I really do like that product, but I don't like the price tag on it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right. I did this on purpose because I'm like, you know what? I just got it. I just have to. Everybody knows about the Totally Awesome, right? Okay. Let me get this bottle. And this thing, will it, it does a lot. It's it's an all-purpose concentrated cleaner and degreaser spot removal. No acid, no ammonia, no bleach, non-flammable. Flammable. And it tells you all the stuff that it takes out. So I got this is how many ounces in here? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Um, 20 fluid ounces. Okay. So that's that one. Well, then it's grandmother. What's well, next door? Look at the difference in it this way. So this is a refill, obviously. And this has got 32 ounces. So I'm thinking to myself, if you keep your spray bottle, then we can get you another one. Because that's just crazy, don't you think? And this is a scene on TV. It was on TV. Missed it. But anyways, I like this. Up. See, the anyways, it's got to go. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go to this. I need some more spray. Fresh, new day, fresh linen air wick. I do like the smell of this, and this smells very, very good. And I'm sorry, you gotta have, you got to have the sprays in the bathroom, especially when you live with boys and men. Boys to men, you know what I'm saying. Okay, so let's see what is this? Okay, I just don't have this on a very good angle. I don't know why, but I don't. Okay, so toilet bowl cleaner. Does it need to be explained? No, it does not. But this stuff does good. I just wish that Dollar Tree had full-size bottles of this. I don't like that knockoff. I've tried it. And then those ones you can put in the back of the toilet, those don't work. So, there you go. First your money, then close it. That's what my daddy always used to say. So, Freeman Renewing Peel-Off Gel Mask. Cucumber Fresh. I only got this for one reason. Because Kylie is such a... <laughs> she likes it when Graham puts this on and she picks it all off. I love the kit. But anyways, this is a full-size bottle, you guys. And I've got a lot of these. Not this particular, the peel but I've got the other ones. And they do a great job. You know what? I'm challenging you guys to challenge me to challenge you guys to do some self-care time. Like, you know, I had to, is it Thrifty Tiffany? said she, And she showed the whole video of just like pedicure and manicure in her own home. And just, just you know, I don't know if she did pedicure or manicure, but. I'm visualizing this because I knew that she was doing self-care and masks and lotions and all. I thought, you know what? We women, we don't take time out to do that kind of thing. Because why? 
We're always busy taking care of everybody else and not ourselves. So just remember that. We have to think about that. So ch let's challenge each other, okay? All right. I also got some ketchup because I'm making sloppy joes. I make sloppy joes. Super, super, super easy. I like manwich, but my kids won't eat the vegetables. I have to hide it inside the food. Yes, my adult children. I know. And look what I bought myself. This is so stupid, but I so needed. A spoon rest. Had to have one. You know how it goes. I'm not going to say it. Anyways. <laughs> So, this find was, I was very excited, especially when I came home and showed Mike, because um, he said that's a name brand, that's a big deal. So, this is hilarious party game called Real Lies, and I am going to take this up at our family Christmas, and I think we're going to try to do this. Um, the only time making up lies about your friends is a good thing. Well, hopefully we can have some fun. We'll see. So, it's got that. And for it being a full-size game, I was very impressed. I almost really wanted to go back and get smart, but then what if we don't like the game? Try to bring something new to the table. Um, I'm not a puzzle doer, but my sister-in-law is, and so they'll sit there and do a puzzle together. It drives me crazy. No, not that they're doing it. It's just I don't have that attention span to sit there. Yes, I have adult ADD. Did you know that? <laughs> yeah, no, no. Okay, all right, all right. This is, um, I'm missing the bowls. I couldn't find the bowls, and I'm hoping I can go back. So, this is a plate. This is a plate, guys. Look at this. And it's four-piece, and it's BPA-free. And I got this for, you know, when for Kylie, but I also said, you know, this would be an all right little thing to put, like, a snack on instead of hauling out a bunch of other, you know, dishes or whatever you're doing. Hold on, I'm going to take this off. I want to see what that looks like. Yeah, so who's dying to put their fall stuff out, and who has a fall stuff out? Because that's what I'm doing tomorrow, is I'm going to get fall stuff out. Oh, these are so cute. I like these a lot. Let's see if they say, mm -hmm. where's my glasses at? Here they are. I knew there was a reason I had these. It does not say. Hmm, that's concerning. Oh, nope. Top rack only, dishwasher safe, and microwave safe. There you go. That's the answer. That's what I was looking for. So four of these and four cups, and I'm looking for the bowls. Hopefully I find them. I thought that was a great find. Okay. Um, Let's see. Let's see. I got some more of these because I found a new way to do my um hair. For me, it's new. Um, Putting it up in a bun. So I have to show you. Maybe I'll do a little ice. Stuff's a-coming, you guys. I'm, I'm changing my ways here. I'm seeing the light that I got to put some more work into this because I enjoy it. I just got afraid, and I was just a lot of stuff going on. We're going to go through that, too. Not today. All right. This is the Copper Care Helps Soothe Aches and Muscles Copper Compression Brace for your ankle. Looks like that. And I have a ankle that does not feel good to the left when I was in a car accident about 30 years ago. And he told me that I'd have been better off breaking my leg. Because it's bad. It hurts. It's something else. Yeah, I'm going to try this. Looks like that. So normally I'd have shots put in my left foot, you know, once every six weeks. Because that's the thing that was, that was a game changer for me. I got more movement. Well then, life has it the way it is and you just can't afford it. But now I'm on Medicare or Medicaid. Which one of it is? I can't do it. I don't know. One of them. All right. This is the next thing that I was so excited about. And I don't know about you guys, but whenever I get anything with liquid, I have them double bag it. This is the Yardley Body Mist. And this is English Lavender. You see that? Okay. And then I got the English Rose. All right. And then I got the Summer Breeze. Summer Breeze makes me feel fine. Oh, let's take a minute for Jimmy Buffett. He was a good guy. He really was. 76 years old. We, he passed away, I think it was yesterday, the day before. Yeah, kind of sad. Margaritaville will never be the same. Okay. I digress. So, 
These are two fluid ounces. They're not ginormous, but you know what? To put in your bag to go to the lake. You girls know how you are. There you go. Let's see if I can do this. Hi. <laughs> Thumbnail. Squirrel. All right. So I found four of these, and I didn't know this is a name brand thing, but apparently it is. I hauled one a while ago, and it's, this is a very good lotion. Limited edition Love Beauty and Planet Marula Oil and Cedarwood Walk in the Woods Body Lotion. This stuff is fantastic and it's name brand and you can get that at the Dollar Tree. Go and run because it won't be there very long. I didn't know this is a thing and they had another kind when I first got this about two months ago. I'm like, doggone it. But I didn't know. Now you know. So, I got that. So, now there's, you notice there's four. That's for the four grand. So, they got that. They'll get the little cleansing thing, a couple other things, and then they'll get a gift card. You know, because they don't want all that junk from Grandma. Because <laughs> it reminds me of my Grandma Ford. God, I, I talk about her all the time, but I love that woman. Best woman ever. She sold Avon. What do you think I got for Christmas? Avon! Yep. All right. That's good. Hey. Anybody find a use for this yet? Because I got one use and it's underneath my, I have a, a table next to my chair and I just throw everything there. So I organized it, but my, I only got 20 pairs of these, like laying all over the house. Some loose jewelry, some, you know, that kind of thing that goes right nice and neat. The only thing I'm not really wild about is the color. So I thought I might spray paint this like gold or something. Stay tuned. We'll see what we can do. All right, how many minutes do we got in at 16 points, something, something, and something? Okay, as I told you, I am doing Mike and I's um, walls in here. I just thought that was precious. So, make sure you guys get one. I got my eye on you. <laughs> um, I really like that. I didn't see any other kind. I seen plain ones, like with nothing, um, but a word. And I thought, nah, I don't want to mess with that. So, we just got something different. There you go. This is the silliest little deal I found, but I thought it was cute. This is a, if I can talk today, it's a car window clean. So you put it on the back of your car and it looks scary. Look at how scary and yucky, yucky, yucky he is. So I thought that would be kind of fun to, you know, put on the side of the car, probably back of the car. I don't know, someplace on the car. Okay, so I got another one of these. So stay tuned for, uh, DIY, do it yourself. <laughs> I get that screwed up every time. And then I get, you know. Mike is going to make me something. I can't wait. I'm so super excited. I can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. So, there you go. You just have to wait like me and just wait it out. Right in the storm out. All right. So, believe it or not, I found books. Yeah, I found books. But before I get that today, I got this um, gray uh, creepy cloth. Okay, so if you see something in the Dollar Tree, you better get it because it's not going to be there very long. Okay, I'm just letting you know right now, it will not be there very long. All right, the only stickers I got was these, and the only reason I got it because of the unicorn. I thought that was the cutest thing in the world. See the little unicorn? Cute. So you get um, 35 pieces. I think that's a pretty doggone good deal, you know? This was my favorite. You know what? I'm going to save that for last. Okay. So I got this from my son's girlfriend. This is green smoothies. It's got all of your stuff. There are 66 recipes and a seven-day detox plan. Looks like that. Um, it is $14.99 here in the U.S. and $19.99 in Canada. And I got it for a dollar and some change. But they just have, you know, different variations of this and what you can do with it. All right. So that's pretty cool. Then the next thing I found was your guide to a glo global food adventure. The unofficial Disney Parks Epcot cookbook. 100 Epcot inspired recipes for eating and drinking around the world. And it looks like this. And it was, how much was it? I 
think, why do they do that? They don't want anybody to know. Why it's a big deal. Who cares how much a book is? If you got it for a buck and some change, you know. Oh, it's not going to let me do it. So, let's not worry about it. Okay, so it looks like that. All right. So, let's see. Um, jumbo pretzels. It's got the recipe for that. All right. Okay, see what else they got. Ah. Oh, no. That doesn't. Oh, banana cheesecake. What does that say? Egg rolls. I want some right now. That sounds delicious. Maple popcorn. I like popcorn. I'm a popcorn. Just crazy about popcorn. Anyways, go get this. It's a really fun cookbook, and I'm going to have fun with that. All right. So this one is the Caroline Bryan Hand-Lettered Home DIY Wood Science Farmhouse Decor. I'm going to also share this with my one of my besties, um, Angie. And she has got the most beautiful gallery. Her home is just charming. Just charming. But this gives you ideas because, see, for me, I have to see something for me to do it. Because I can't, I don't think like that. So it just gives you ideas and how to dye things. And I've always wanted to learn how to do that. And to um, use, like, for, you know, color your, what the word am I looking for? Don't get sepsis. This is what happens. Varnish is something I could think of. You know, you you varnish it and make it, you know, look really antique. -y. So why can't I just think about that? I don't know. Let's stay home. I like that. Now, if you have a cricket, great. Go to town on your cricket. I got a couple of them. Yeah, I got a friend that's got five of them, but I'm not mentioning no names. Girl, I love you. <laughs> I'm coming shopping. Uh-huh. Okay, last but not least, this was a favorite find. It might not be for you, but it was for me. Because I'm hoping and praying that I got a wedding in the family soon. This is a honeymoon journal. Prompts, checklists, tips, free space to help you plan your dream trip and treasure your favorite moments forever. The editors of The Knot. Okay, so it looks like this. Okay. Um, again, they got the price cover. It's got a little band thing. I like that. Okay, so this is this is for their names and how to use the journal. Tell you how to use it. And it's got you're married, so you can write there. And then it's just got tons and tons of little fun things. Important contacts, time to pack, your little. Ch this is awesome. Checklist. Yep, I like it. So I just I grabbed. Daydream. Then he's got, this is a fun, fun book. I only got two, so I, my thought process was either to give this as a gift at a shower or something like that. So that's why I got two. I love you guys. If you'd be so kind as hit that um, button in the corner. And it'll let you know when we upload a video. And in, what else do I want to say? I want you to say it. Like, comment, share, subscribe down below. Hit the bell in the corner. And... I just went. Anyways, um, remember snail mail because everybody likes getting something good in the mail. Besides that damn bill, I know I do. Do something good for yourself so that you can do something good for somebody else. And above all else, be good. I love you guys. Mwah.